Hello, sir. Greetings of the day. I am very much fine. How about you, sir? So, thank you. Uh, yeah, and greetings to you as well. And thank you so much. Aapka, finally, US student visa got approved. Jesus. Right? And, but you were uh, through the process of 221G. Yes, sir. I think it, it took a while to exactly, get your sir. visa stamped on your passport. Mm -hmm. So how about, uh, uh, Abhishek, you discuss... Uh, uh, the process, I mean, uh, your first experience at the uh, embassy, U.S. embassy, and what was the reason you think they put you on hold for 221G processing? Okay. So, sir, I think means uh, my research area falls in, under TAL, so that is the main reason for 221G. Okay. And apart from that, uh, I just missed few documents. Uh, so uh, later on, I requested my university to provide me that missing document, and then after that, I emailed. Well, what was the, what were those documents? Uh, it was the invitation letter, and uh, yes, it was the invitation letter on. Okay. So uh, okay, okay, and can you share your experience with the visa officer? What did he ask? those kind of things? Yes, sir. Visa officer was very normal and the interviews went very normal. Uh, he asked very few questions like, uh, what is your research area? Why you are choosing only US and why particular university? Mm -hmm. And that's it. And uh, your visa was where? New Delhi? Uh, yeah, saying? at Delhi Embassy, at US New Delhi Embassy. So can you can you share uh, your experience in a way? What what answers uh, you provide to them? Yeah, sure, sir. Uh, first of all, he asked a little introduction regarding me. What is my background? Where I studied, and what I did after my masters. So I told him that. I did my bachelor's and master's from CSV to Bilai, and then after that, I worked as college professor for two plus years. Mm -hmm. So he appreciated, <laughs> and then after that, I planned my PhD at US, and I applied for five universities, mm -hmm. and I got uh, admitted into. So I got offer letter from two US university. The first mm -hmm. one is University of Miami. Mm -hmm. And the second one is University of Pittsburgh. Mm -hmm. So he asked why you choose an uh, University of Miami, why not Pittsburgh? Mm -hmm. So I replied that uh, my research inclination, uh, what I did in my master's uh, actually matches with the research profile of the professor at the University of Miami. Mm -hmm. And in the Department of uh, Mechanical and Aerospace Engineering at University of Miami, Mm -hmm. uh, it's working on materials. Okay. So my previous work is on materials. So that's the main reason why I chose an University of Miami over University of Pittsburgh. And what kind of materials? Uh, yeah, composite materials. Uh, composite materials, advanced lightweight materials. Okay. Uh, so I am. I will be working in the direction of medical implants, like uh, biodegradable uh, materials, which can be used as a replacement of titanium and stainless steel implants. What after was the youth conversation was going on? What visa officer was doing something on, on his PSA? Yes, he was, he was continuously typing something and he asked to document like, uh, first of all, he asked my passport mm -hmm. and then after that, uh, he asked uh, that uh, whether I have any invitation letter from university or not. Okay, so okay. at that moment, uh, I was uh, not given with the invitation letter from university. And but you did have the offer letter. How about that? Was it yes. not its replacement? Yeah, offer letter was there, but uh, few, few information were missing okay. in the offer letter. That's mm -hmm. why he was seeking the invitation letter. Oh, So do you think, suppose you would have had invitation letter or some missing document, your case uh, would not have gone to 221G? I'm not so sure, sir, because uh, materials falls under okay. 221G. 
means a TL technology alert. So it's a bit the sensitive research area. Okay. So it might be the reason. Okay. And yeah. But at the same time, you know, there are a number of students. They they are working okay. or they are going to work on the materials and their visa gets approved. I mean. Uh, in five minutes yes, or 30 sir. seconds. <laughs> so don't mm -hmm. you think it's like uh, very random? Just be honest. I mean, uh, yeah, I, mean, say, I think I mean, say it very case to case, yes. is officer to officer, <laughs> and okay. something like that. Yeah. Okay. So, I mean, uh, after the visa, uh, what did he say? Uh, he he told me that nothing to worry, just okay. uh, go to counter number one and they will provide you a list of document and you just need to email them okay. as soon as possible awesome. and we will keep processing your application as soon as possible. Were so you I upset? did the same. Sorry, sir. Were you upset by listening? Such yeah, I was a bit nervous. Uh, I would... I was a bit nervous and I already discussed these things with you. Mm -hmm. uh, that yeah, this, uh, this has yeah. happened and you yeah. told me that yeah, we should nothing to worry and yeah. we'll keep working yeah. on it. Yeah. So, yeah. yeah and and so, when you return home and, and, I re uh, and I returned home, I requested my university to provide an invitation letter mm -hmm. and I collected all the document like and what? I drafted yeah and i drafted in a very systematic manner mm -hmm. uh, according to the details given in the 221g letter mm -hmm. uh, in the word format and i emailed all the documents uh, in a single mail mm -hmm. uh, to the embassy okay. and i think it took almost uh, 22 22 days okay. means i got uh, means my interview was on 18th mm -hmm. and i 18th I of June. Got, yeah, 18th of June. Mm -hmm. And then after that, I emailed them my missing documents on 21st June. Okay. And I got reply from them on 14th of July. Okay. So you're, you're you're missing. You got, so what did they say on 14th of July? Uh, means that they just replied that means your case is under admin processing, administrative processing, mm -hmm. and you, you need to submit your passport at your nearest embassy okay so i submitted my passport at bac yeah. visa application center us us embassy new delhi no. on 16 okay and then my case uh, my, then my case uh, turned into admin processing As earlier it was refused okay. and then it turned into admin processing okay and on uh, 19th uh, i got the confirmation that my visa has been issued okay. and 19th of July and after uh, two or three days okay. uh, means after confirmation I received my passport. So when did you receive passport on, on which date? Uh, I received on 25th of July sir. July. So it was like uh, uh, a month plus at a complete yeah. process yes. and a week uh, ahead and you get your yes, visa stamped uh, in your passport. Yes, sir. It took almost uh, 30 to 35 days, as I would say. Complete processing. Yeah. Do you want to, now you have a, I mean, uh, experience in a way, uh, do you want to give some message to the aspirants going through the yeah, sure. process? I would say that, yeah, I would say, means uh, just keep preparing all the documents from very initial. Um, and so that uh, you you haven't missed any document at the time of your interview or at the application process and yeah and uh, just keep preparing with basic questions like means what will what you'll be going to research or, and like uh, means uh, what what is your previous background means these these are the basic question i think means a student mm -hmm. must be prepared with and how about it? Pucha jaye simple sir. Kya pehen ke gaye the ya? Kapde kya pehen? Ah uh, sir, agar dressing sense ki baat ki jaye to matlab semi formal kya sakte hain. Maine trouser pehna hua tha aur ek formal shirt tha. Acha. And no tie. No tie. <laughs> Shaker was asking the other day. I think Shaker is going to have tomorrow. Ki main yes, tie laga ke jaao. Maine pucha ki ab Shaker se puchu kya usne tie lagayi thi. <laughs> 
नहीं बट आई वुड रिकमेंड की मीन एज पॉसिबल कि आप फॉर्मल में ही जाएं तो वो ज्यादा बेटर है एंड बी कंफर्टेबल आई थिंक यस सर गुड आई थिंक वी आर सो हैप्पी दैट योर योर वीजा इज योर स्टूडेंट वीजा गॉट अप्रूव्ड एंड फॉर सर बधाई उस बात के लिए और आई थिंक यू आर ऑल थैंक यू सो मच टू द यूएस वेरी सून टू योर ड्रीम यूनिवर्सिटी तो इसमें एक क्वेश्चन जरूर पूछना चाहूंगा एज अ फीडबैक जो वी वी हैड दिस Zoom मीटिंग यू यू आर मिसिंग एंड द Zoom मीटिंग and uh, we had some conversation with you prior to your visa appointment was it helpful in any way about our our discussion or something or you were yes sir exactly exactly sir it was a very helpful part for me ki hum sari cheeze pehle se discuss kiye aur means familiar rahe sari processes se to definitely it helped me a lot कि मेंस जो मेंस लेट्स टू जीआरई प्लेटफॉर्म से कनेक्ट हो पाया मैं आपसे कनेक्ट हो पाया तो जो आपके वैल्यूएबल सजेशंस सजेशंस थे और गाइडलाइंस थे मैंने उनको फॉलो किया और डेफिनेटली इट हेल्प मी अ लॉट आई हैव गॉन थ्रू द हैव यू वाच द वीडियो ज़ूम मीटिंग वीडियो लेट मी आस्क यस सर यस मैंने शिखर की मतलब एनयूएस की वीडियो देखे और बाकी मतलब आई एम आस्किंग अबाउट Zoom meeting uh, uh, visa interview video have you exactly sir maine sonali ke dekhe the aur okay. uh, sonam ke bhi sonam okay okay, okay. You, visa right. interview dekhe the to okay unke experiences se maine kafi kuch ha sikha okay. how about uh, uh, were your our help was useful in resolving uh, our completing 221 g documents Yes, sir. Definitely, my slides to GRE platform provided me uh, end-to-end solution from the very beginning. Mm-hmm. Either it was drafting of CV, either it was drafting research proposal. Yeah, I was talking about two twenty-one G when uh, the documents uh, you have to send through him. हाँ सर एग्जैक्टली मीन टू ट्वेंटी वन जी में भी मतलब हेल्प मिला जैसे मैंने आपसे डिस्कस किया yes, yes. वर्ड फॉर्मेट में क्या स्ट्रक्चर होना चाहिए और मीन्स और इफेक्टिव कैसे हम अपने ईमेल्स को बना सकते हैं तो डेफिनेटली इसमें भी हेल्प मिला आप सर ओके सो इवेंचुअली आई थिंक द प्रोसेस काइंड ऑफ अ पेनफुल बिकॉज़ नो वन वांट्स द रिजेक्शन और रिफ्यूजल बट आई वुड से हैव पेशेंस इट्स नथिंग टू वरी व्हेन यू हैव फुल्ली फंडेड स्पॉन्सर्ड प्रोग्राम एचजी और एम यस just a matter of time and they have to i mean grant you the visa anyways exactly so yeah i mean i was keep on i remember you were when you were frustrated or disappointed i was saying this is i was a little bit nervous yeah there was uh, the experience of life ka part hai uh, exactly so i gave you example of sanjay maratra also uh, mm, yes you see or a job multiple time unka uh, visa got exactly, so. refused but ultimately so we can live on it's nothing to worry exactly sir although it was a great learning experience yeah learning experience now you can say that you <laughs> means yeah, 221g ke bare mein pata chala pata chala otherwise it's smooth hota you would never know okay, what what is this exactly, i sir. never went through the process exactly uh, so yeah nothing was lost rather you you gain some experience mm-hmm. through the process yes.